Today, one man dead and two others injured after a shooting at a wedding reception in Sydney. Race to the finish, Barack Obama and Mitt Romney make a frantic dash through the key swing states in the final days of the campaign. We've come too far to turn back now. We've come too far to let our hearts grow faint. It's time to keep pushing forward. Budget blow, an independent report, says slower growth in China will turn the government's planned surplus into a deficit. And fresh from their visit to PNG, the Prince of Wales and the Duchess of Cornwall head to Queensland. Good morning, you're watching ABC News 24. I'm Jane Hutchin. First, a quick look at the weather. Partly cloudy in Brisbane, Canberra and Hobart, mostly sunny in Sydney, a few showers in Melbourne and Perth, showers and storms in Adelaide and Darwin. Well, Wall Street fell on Friday despite a positive employment report. The Australian share market is expected to slip at the open and we'll update the figures shortly. A man has died after being shot at a wedding reception in Sydney's southwest overnight. 23-year-old Falau Pisu died in hospital this morning. Two other men were also shot and both remain in a stable condition in hospital. Jason Om reports from the scene. This shooting at a wedding party at Canley Vale has taken a dramatic turn and now police are looking for...